precisely key. What I see is this is a white hole, black hole loop. They show you like the space folded and you know, like a black hole. Uh, they show you folding space like a piece of paper like this. The more you watch when I see what I see to you, this is what I'm saying. If you can turn it sideways, that's what they're showing you, that folding space. And when you're eating your eating your mission component, it's all the same story over and over and over again. There's no way to mess this up. There, there's no way to mess up. There's nothing to confuse here. If this is just a flat plane with a diving bell on top of it, like you showed you a Marvel, Kevin Costner, bringing that girl underwater, let him breathe underwater, and he brought her in this diving bell. That diving bell is uh, on top of us. And what I'm saying to you is that it's the two bowls, the two bowls, in other words, there's another dome below us that keeps everything in there, that under sun. So we have like the underdog, all these terminologies. It's all pointing to the same thing. Did you see it? Yeah, of course. Should you see that you have the overdog, underdog, the black sheep, you know, all these terminologies are telling you something. There's just two basic parts to this entire thing, which that those two basic parts turn out to be one sun rather than two. So we see this best of Pisces over here. That's there because one side of a light hole is a black hole. That's the two spheres of influence, which is the division symbol that we're seeing over here. Now the best of Pisces can be represented by this symbol right there. You see it, the division symbol? Yeah, that's something over here that Again, we would be inside the football because, you know, because of that, it's the two, one side of the white hole is a black hole, we're on the division side of the symbol. The people below us on the other side of that grid are in perpetual twilight. So we hear all these stories about under earth, hollow earth, all that stuff. What they're telling you is that there's another side. In the present of Christmas, right? And they're showing you that. If you could put this symbol right here inside that box, okay, that would mean that we're all inside this box, and the way out of this box turns out to be the other side of that hole. And that's why they're showing you, if you want a, a life preserver, they're showing you the four rivers going into that hole, and it's like a sphincter is breathing, bringing the tides every six hours. And it's just what I'm saying is that over here, you see, uh, this was from the... Uh, there's a DVD I, that we, I saw in a, it was just in the drawer, like from many years ago, but it's a climb with a chance of meatballs, climbing with a chance of meatballs. See the meatballs fall over the sky? That's like Raining Men. That's like that Raining Men song. Uh, cause balls, you know what I mean? And yeah, yeah, yeah. that I took out of that picture, I sent it up. It shows you the middle six. It's the middle six. So when you see six, 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 one side of the light holds a black hole, you need the middle hole. The Holy of Holies at the center of the dish. And that's, it's just that simple. The Holy Grail, the Spear of Destiny, that pierces, that's the Christmas tree you set up every year. Yeah, they bury us six feet under, under, underground also. What was that? They bury us six feet underground also. That's right, that's another point. They, it's, that's a good point. It, it's the same story over and over again. And aliens are a lie, and they're a lie to that alien, see that? A lie. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I agree with that. But if you go put a white hand on that's why Duquesne service is sure like a man and vice. So service, it's all, everything says homosexual undertone for a reason. So, uh, you know, you say to a man in Australia, a laddie, which is the word lady. And I have a mate, that's my woman, my wife, right? But you call a man mate. He's your first mate on your ship. And what I'm saying to you is that it's kind of funny how people don't see this sort of stuff. Like tennis is anus, and hmm. pro gay ram. The G definitely stands for for gay because of the feature of reality, which is they're showing you that the sun and the moon have to place their light into that hole. So the moon is setting down. Originally, it's one side of a light hole is a black hole. That's the U with the two dots. Turn it this way. That's Face folded on me like this. A piece yeah. of the grid was taken off, placed up in the sky. It's the same polarity as the grid itself. Therefore, the same poles are pushing apart on each other. You understand me? And opposite poles attract. So if they took a piece of grid from underneath and put it up there, it would have slapped down. But the grid from on top, where we're at, 
place up in the sky is sending down a swirl wave at us. And that's how they keep us in slavery with everybody sleeping. And the only way around it is by raising, if you're, if you have, if you give out gratitude and love to people, you're raising your frequency by accident, you know, above this particular point, and you find yourself waking up. But you have to get in that direction, and it, it's like little bit by little bit, and then it grows and grows and grows, and mm-hmm. you get past a certain point, you start to see everything. Where do you think uh, dreams are actually like glimpses uh, into the other side, the, the black hole side? Oh, uh, you like a glimpse uh, into it? Well, I can tell you this, that, that sounds likely because the black hole sun, that's the part that, that deals with all the stuff you don't actually see. The, the real magic of things, like, I want this, I want that, and then it comes into reality. Whereas the sun is making your flesh and bones and blood, the other sun is the hidden occult part that they hid from everybody. But yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I, I was also going to say that you said the sun's conscious, so could the black hole sun be subconscious? That's exactly. right there. That's right. Yeah. That's exactly right. When you, you put something in the action like magic, once you don't with your spell, whatever it is, every word you speak is a magic spell, then you either put it behind you into your subconscious. So, mm-hmm. like, uh, you know, you, they say, well, like, if you don't like reading and they talk about, like, magic spells and stuff, they tell you, once you're done with the spell, you have to put it behind you into your subconscious. And that makes sense. I'm glad you pointed that out. Yeah, yeah, and also, also if you're aware of like, uh, I don't know if you've ever had lucid dreaming or anything, I, I've had those uh, situations many, many, many times, especially younger, but I don't recall ever seeing the daylight in my dreams, always night for some weird reason. It's always, always seems to be night. Either somebody's running after me and I'm trying to fly up in the air, but it's always night, never day. That's a and you don't have any kind of those, you don't seem to go anywhere, it feels like, yeah. like somebody's holding a bag. Yeah, yeah, where you at? <laughs> don't fall. It, it, yeah, exactly. It, it's like uh, try, it's like giving you a glimpse on the other side and telling you at the same time you're not ready for it. So it, you can't really go exploring. You're like, we'll give you a look, but... I've been on Earth, man. No, no. Thank you, Sammy. I don't, I don't know if I've ever seen that interview. No, me either. I was checking it out though. It was pretty cool. Yeah, was, I'm not sure who was. Who he said it was like two and a half years. That was from old. a few years back though. Mm-hmm. He was like two and a half years into his blood over intent. He said. So there's been a lot of discoveries too since yeah, it's then. Not, it's not longer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's some real shit, man. So all we gotta do is just stay together and keep gathering up that information, you know? Yes, sir. There's a lot of it out there. We can get information. We can show people, but yeah. I'm trying to wake keep people up. Yeah, going. Too, so. we gotta get a platform. Mm-hmm. Get 144,000. Oh, shit. Come join us. I'm in the process of making all these. Something missing on Earth. Put 144,000. It's 144 right now. You said that again. <laughs> you said that last time. You said 144 when it was 144 twice in this video. It's like Matt. You can't fuck it up, Michael. You just can't. We got it. No. Twenty-four, four thousand. But yeah, his message is what brought is what brought all of us together for real. So. Backups on the way. <laughs> okay. Right. Mhm. Yeah. It's Mark that opened the book of life. Yeah. And showed us how to place our name in the same book. Here you go. Here's a blank page for you. <laughs> Start writing. <laughs> go, yep. go, 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 go. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, how it should be. It's well, like the fifth one of the Fibonacci that goes in spiral, channel, like uh, channel, dude, 144. Like that's when. Uh, 
Like, go back and look at all them videos from years ago, dude. You go to all our channels, like Brian's, yours, Mark's channel, and you got to scroll all the way down, and it takes a while, but you scroll all the way down and get to the good, good, good videos, you know? Good videos from back in the day. Yeah, they buried us. They tried to, anyways. They, they, I don't know what they were thinking. We need to reboot that. You know, you know what? That's because we were alive. Michael, we need to you reboot that. You know what? The one that I noticed that you, know, you can want to go like, back to your old videos and add tags to it and retitle them, and it changes it changes the algorithm for it. I, I, I've, I've been doing that with my old videos. Like, I went to the last video I did. Um, it was like a video, a 50 second video about an eclipse. And then I added different tags to it. And I say, instead of saying how Eclipse is on a flat earth, I changed the title to how Eclipses work on earth. You know? Right, right, and then right. I changed, I just added mad tags to it, like NASA, RASA, fucking sun, moon, and shit like that. And yeah, it added a lot more views to it within a, a matter of minutes. And I was just like, yo, you, I'm going to go back to all of my videos and change it, change titles and add tags oh, wow. to it. Because a lot of your old videos, you, you, you didn't have the opportunity to add tags. Yeah, that's right. Real pop a tag, pop a tag. Mm. So I suggest everyone go back to their old shit too and that's just awesome. you know, we update yeah, it. Any, anything to help get the to the people. There's no soul left behind, so the more people we can reach, the better. We're trying, trying to fight through this tyranny, digital genocide. I'm like, yo, how come I'm not like, putting blood over intent into the recommended video feed? Hmm. Hmm. Can I share a video? But then they picked yeah, it Yeah, sure. They blocked it out. As long as they know how it was. Who is the first to vote as the black sun, which is truly the great dragon torn from the mother of all creation? <laughs> Taught himself with all his son in the suit. The ancient Egyptian god, which was self this is serious. Make it full screen. The suit was named after the planet Saturn, which is called in earlier times in history concerning Christianity, Satan, or Lucifer. Lucifer is not just female or male. Make it full screen, Joshua. He is the ancient creator of both male and female. Tophan is set up both now and joined as one and then joined into existence. So the Egyptian myths of these two gods, separate beings, are basically not correct. Adam and Eve in the Garden of Eden are just another myth. Now the microcosm of Godhood as seen in Tophan is set, being self begotten, but as a microcosm in the creation theory of humanity. Point out the black sun is symbolic of the creator. The black goddess Typhon in the land of Kim, the black land of Egypt. She was the creator of the black race, the first race of man. The black sun is indeed hidden and not recognized by the masses as the true sun, but the people are led to believe that the sun is represented by the yellow invisible color we see in the sky. Yet the mystery deepens still. Since this is the miracle cause of our existence, the true black sun, or the true Lucifer is hidden deep in the symbology of the macrocosm. There are three forms of suns known in esoteric literature. The third is largely hidden in many books, the past and the present. Is the term the sun behind the sun? Is the term the sun behind our local sun called Sirius? There are three serious planets, A, B, and C, which are cosmically allude to the existence of three suns. The third sun is called the galactic sun, which is a black hole in the depths of our solar system. The sun is the true god of all existence. It's not Lucifer or Typhon. These are solely alien beings that created mankind. This true god is the creator of the alien being. The black sun is the black hole of the creator. This true creator is by with so much secrecy, it's hard to find information on his existence. This God is also called the super solar force, 